If you want to be one of the best, you have to endure a lot. Pressure. Heat. Always working on your top form, constantly testing your performance. If you pass all these tests, you'll have all the options. High-performance ceramics are indispensable. You think you know ceramics? Let us take you on a journey through the world of Ceramtech and learn about all possible dimensions of this high-tech material. A material that's just getting started when others are giving up. Heat-resistant, either electrically insulating or conductive. Stainless. Chemically extremely stable. Virtually indestructible. And biocompatible. This makes ceramics the material the future is made out of. To this end, we are constantly developing new materials and processes, such as additive, tool-free manufacturing of green bodies in 3D printers for particularly complex geometries. We create ceramic components that are indispensable for the semiconductor industry. Piezo-ceramic flow sensors for high-precision measurement of liquid quantities robust substrates for high-performance electronics. Take a look with us at an exemplary manufacturing process for technical ceramics. Here is your companion throughout production, a sealing and regulation disc made of oxide ceramics, which is necessary for temperature management in electric cars. In its tough everyday use, it is surrounded by cooling liquid and has to regulate the fluid flow with minimum friction and wear. The basis for such top performance is found in the soil. Silicates and metallic compounds which occur in many places of the world. The desired material properties define the individual mixture for each product as well as the grinding of the raw materials, which produces a fine powder. The following is true for every recipe. It's all about select ingredients, their exact dosage, and a lot of insider knowledge. This is how we form our technical ceramics. Depending on the formula, the finished mass is dry pressed under high pressure, or a liquid is added to it before pressing. We design and manufacture the necessary pressing tools ourselves. Pressing produces what we in technical ceramics call a green body, not because of its color, but because it is still unfinished, an intermediate step. After pressing, the green body is further processed, for example, in order to get deburred. The green body is still raw. Ceramics only obtain their final properties through heat. This process is called sintering. In large sintering furnaces, the sealing and regulation disks are exposed to temperatures of up to 1,600 degrees Celsius. They stay in the sintering furnace for two days. The exact temperature curve is part of the specific formula for these components. In the heat of the oven, the material forms an indissoluble compound. Its particles condense. Any moisture and organic substances contained in the material evaporate completely. This reduces the size of the regulator disks by around 20%, shrinking them to their pre-calculated dimensions. Through the sintering process, the disks have obtained their desired properties. Resistant to abrasive liquids, extremely low friction and low wear. To get them into perfect shape, they now get their finish. They are grounded and lapped because the surface quality is also a guarantee for top performance. But we don't forgive any mistakes. Only the ceramic components that meet our quality standards are allowed to bear our name. This way, ceramics remain ready for any application, now and in the future.